Yo, what's up, guys? I hope you guys like the new intro, because that took quite a while to make. You better like it, or else I'm going to find you and kill you. Nah, just re nah, not really. I'm just messing with you. Um, so, yeah. I got a battle here against Embor Crazy Dude. Uh, I met him in a Pokemon Showdown battle once. We became friends on Skype, and um, he requested to do a battle with me, so I said, yeah. This battle is kind of unusual, because we both use kind of awkward teams. Like, I use a mono bug team. Oh, let's just give ahead to the team preview. Yeah, see, there's my mono bug team. And he's got a rather odd team as well. He's got Embor and Sceptile, which, and, which are unusual in OU. Sandslash is definitely un unusual in OU. And there's also Electivire. Again, not really a common sight. My Pokemon aren't exactly common either. I have Scolipede, Masquerain, and Crustle on my team, which are not normally seen in OU. Same with Galvantula. Um, the biggest threat to my team is probably going to be Embor, because Embor can take out like four of my Pokemon easily. So yeah, I'll have to be wary of that, plus any rock type attacks or as well, because rock types are only resisted by Crustle and Fortress. So yeah, I gotta be wary of that. And in any case, let's start the battle. So he's gonna lead off with his Mammoth Swine, I lead off with my Atari. Yeah, you have to be like, really old in order to get that reference. Uh, he goes for Ice Shard right off the bat as I set up my spikes. So yeah, just to get that spike damage in there. He goes for the Earthquake, that knocks me down to the red zone. I barely live that. I'm gonna go for a Mega Horn next turn. That doesn't really do a whole lot. He goes for Stone Edge the next turn, so this Mammoth Swine isn't choice. Which is kind of unusual, but that's okay. This is another unusual thing. He gets some Berry to raise his special defense, which is rather odd since Mammoth Swine doesn't really need the defense anyways. He goes for superpower. He could have just gone for Earthquake and taken me out, but I don't, hey, who am I to judge? So now I bring out Cockroach because this thing is clearly a Cockroach and not a Flaming Moth. So yeah, it's a Cockroach. I, because I say it's a Cockroach, deal with it. So now he brings out Sand Slash and um, I'm going to back out of there because I fear the Stone Edge. I'm going to go into Fortress. He goes for Earthquake. He asked if this Volcarona had Levitate, and I said no, so I knew the Earthquake was coming, but, um... Still. So anyways, I bring out Shit and Bricks, because this thing shits bricks. Like, as, and by bricks I mean screens. So I go for the Reflect and switch out to Volcarona, predicting the Flare Blitz, but he has Fire Blast instead, so I'm like, God damn it. Could've gone for Light Screen, that would've been more helpful. I go for the Hidden Power Rock, land a critical hit on it, and then he goes for Head Smash and takes me out. So I'm like, okay, this thing is physical, what the fuck? I thought this thing would be totally physical. Yeah, so anyways, I bring out Galvantula, or kill it with fire, because I fucking hate spiders, like, so much. And I go for the Choice Specs Giga Drain. That is going to take out that Sand Slash. Now he goes into Haxorus. I'm like, okay, Giga Drain is not going to do that much damage to this thing. So I'm going to back out into Crustle in order to try and get my um, sweeping done. I go, f He goes for Focus Blast, and I'm like, what? Who puts Focus Blast on their Haxorus? I don't know. Anyways, I go for the Shell Smash on the next turn. That is going to raise my stats up significantly. He went for Aqua Tail that turn, and I'm like, who puts Aqua Tail on their hacks? Seriously. I thought this X Scissor would kill because of the attack boost, but it does not kill. So I'm like, damn. And he kills me with Aqua Tail, so yeah. So he switched out to Shit and Bricks, and he goes for Rest. I'm like, dude. What are you doing? What is with the movesets on these Pokemon? I'm like, dude, you're not taking advantage of their strengths at all. See, so yeah, I go for the Reflect. 
switch out to Galvantula. Go for the Bug Buzz. Choice Specs boosted Bug Buzz will do a lot. Axorus is still sleeping. Yeah, so it's like, I don't understand this guy's strategy at all, but yeah, yeah. So he brings out Sceptile, and I'm like, dude, you know I have Bug Buzz, right? He goes for the Giga Drain. I thought I would be faster, but apparently not. So, yeah, I just go for Bug Buzz and finish him off. So now he brings out his last Pokemon, an Electivire. So I just go for Bug Buzz on that. Almost kills it, not quite, but almost. He goes for Ice Punch. He, he should have probably had Fire Punch on this Electivire. That, that would have killed my Galvantula in a heartbeat. But nope. He goes for I go for Bug Buzz and that is game. So, good game I guess? I don't know. That was kind of odd because um, that was, there was just some odd plays being made all around. So yeah. That's the battle and I hope to see you guys again soon. Bye bye.